Hi guys, Wendy here with Artfully Created. I'm bringing you a Stamp It Up haul video, but I just wanted to show you. Um, I had my first meetup group Thursday night, and I made all the participants little gift bags, and it was an AT swap, and these are the, um, the ATCs I made for each person. I had eight people and my mom was one of them so seven people from the community in my mom's living room um, Thursday night and I made this little um, bookmark for them and provided them with the blank cards and then a little thing for the signature after they were all done, they didn't want to swap cards, so there was no swapping made or done, but it was fun. It was a long evening. It took me two days to prepare, and Thursday morning, I left the house to go get some cat food and a snack for a Thursday night and so while I was in Vaughn's I made it through Petco or PetSmart fine my car was fine I was Vaughn's trying to leave and my car is going I'm like oh no and I had my battery placed like last year October November so I called AAA called my mom said mom can you come and pick up the food because there were some it was blazing hot and I didn't want the stuff to go wonky or bad or melt or anyway so car's fine I'm fine and it's taken me two days to recover but it was fun this Wednesday I have another meetup it's going to be a card making class and I've got two people in that class my mom and myself so far, so four people. And I'm hoping more people come. And these first two classes I was offering is free. So, um, you know, most of it, this, the card making, I'm trying to promote my business. The other one is mixed media. So my meetup group is called Mixed Media Art and Paper Crafting. So if you're in the 805 area code, um, sign up in my group and come to one of my classes. I'd love to see ya. So anyway, I'm going to do this quick video. It's probably going to be long now with me gibbering, jabbering. I have a Christmas class planned, so I got the Festival of Trees. And I got lots of joy. Then I got the Definitely Dahlia, and I use this as my hostess reward, so this was free. I'm going to use this as a background. I've never been a fan of Dahlias, but I saw some um, things made with this, and they were just gorgeous. So I got that. I got the White Perfect Perfect Accents, which I will bring a video demonstrating what you can use those for. I got the Happy Patterns Decorative Mask. And these are really fun patterns. There's that one. That one. That one. And I think there is an embossing folder that has that similar pattern. And then there's dots and I think that says Happy. So that's cool. And some Fast Fuse, which was on sale, which is still on sale until next Monday. I bought some of the new um, tear and tape adhesive. I bought 
one of each of the thick baker's twine they have five colors new colors and i loved the thick baker's twine from the last catalog and they were in the end colors that retired and really fun twine so that was bermuda bay calypso coral cherry cobbler very vanilla and slate really pretty slate color and i bought the gold and silver satin it's five eight inches wide and this is gorgeous it is so soft and supple and it almost looks like a maybe like a vintage antique it's not a bright gold and I just love it so I have a card I was making and I needed the gold ribbon I also got they have a new set of in color ribbon and this is the striped cotton ribbon again 5 8 inches and this is absolutely beautiful it is so soft and from the picture it almost seemed like it was going to be rigid and stiff and it's just beautiful and I want to get all the other colors in that I got these classy designer buttons these were on sale they're still on sale until Monday or they you know the new sales come out every Tuesday so I thought why not so I got very, very vanilla buttons and then stamp it up also has this new gold metallic thread they also have it in silver but I just got the gold just to see what it was like and it is tiny and I don't even know if you can even see that let me see there it is a little bit it is very thin but that might be cute for some decorations I might be able to use it in my holiday themed class and these sequins the bright sequins these are new this catalog and these are on sale and these are so gorgeous there's stars there's hearts there's the classic round ones and I think there's just three styles a little heart and they're kind of jumpy and then the round sequins these are very pretty and I got more of these in color blossom accents that I've purchased in my pre-order I can't believe I already used all those and like I have empty bags and I got the this is the everyday chic washi tape so there's five different colors there's a silver with chevron and black and white kind of a crisscrossy type pattern or diamond shape depending on how you look at it and these are just like X's another black and white and like a silver spot and then a striped so I thought that was pretty and I got another uniball signal white gel pen oh, I got the Christmas tree and 
I believe this was a bundle. Um, so if you can buy things in bundles, you save 15%. So I went ahead and got that. And I know you can easily fussy cut these out, but I like simple easy. You know, it's all about simple easy. <laughs> And these are new Expressions Natural Elements. And I believe there are 15 in here. So there's three different words. There's Celebrate, Congrats, and Thanks. So that will be fun to use. And I thought using that glossy accents that we have after you know decorating it or coloring it would be fun. I also got the Heart and Stars decorative mask. And I started using the stars when I was playing around with the ATC cards and I just could not get my idea perfected so but those are fun to use and I got all the new designer series paper except for one there's one six by six pack that I didn't get I'm still on the fence but the patterns are absolutely gorgeous and this is the animal print one and I heard one demonstrator say say that it would be good for mail cards and I'm thinking you know the black and white and the tip top taupe oh my goodness I love animal print anything and go wild is the name and it's basic black tip top taupe and whisper white are the coordinating colors and then I also got the designer series paper pack in the brights and all these type have the same pattern with the flowers the stripes the words, the polka dots. I've already gotten the neutral from the pre-order and it's fabulous. I just, this year's is just absolutely gorgeous. Everything, every pattern is something I will definitely use. I got the farmer's market and I was on the fence with this but I thought why not and that's a nice tiny polka dot one and I love these stripes probably a good mail card and then the polka dots tomatoes I thought those were cute And then like, like, like a gingham, I think that is. And that's pretty. And then these almost remind me of chicken feet. It's like an, you can see that. But that's sort of how I make little chicken feet. And another gingham. And the pears. Isn't that cute? And then like a white whitewashed fence and just uh, circles and diamonds artichokes how cute and then there's this one I really love the irresistibly yours that was in our celebration they did this one a little bit differently because this is one you can choose your own color if you see this the shiny that's the raised embossed 
and they're one sided. And you got the little little tiny polka dots. And this is kind of a diamond. I love this one. This one's gorgeous. And then stripes. Wood grain. I love wood grain. Uh, so, there you go. Sort of see it. And then some diagonal skinny lines. But then they also colored, give you one colored for each design. And that's okay. I like these too. I can see me using this with a lot of things. Love that wood grain. And then this black one. It's like very sexy. If paper can be sexy. And then I got the in color designer series paper. I'm sorry, I keep bumping into my camera. I've got the Cucumber Crush. Delightful Dijon, Mint Macaron, Tip Top Taupe, and this Tip Top Taupe is a wonderful neutral, and I bought two packs of, well I got one pack with the, the in color um, stamp pads. And then I went and bought another eight and a half by 11 that had all the, like four each of the in colors. And I have gone through two packs already just designing with these colors. And they are really just real beautiful. This is really summery, like an orange watermelon, orangey pink watermelon, if that makes sense. This is the English Garden. And I've seen people making things with this already and absolutely gorgeous, absolutely. Just love these papers. And I never got to use my patent, painted petals that was in the celebration because I thought the paper was just too gorgeous to cut up. And only a paper hoarder would say that. Yes, I am a paper hoarder, but I am going to really try to cut this up and make things with. Oh gosh, it's just so gorgeous. Love that. Oh man. Isn't this beautiful? And the everyday chic and this is a black and white and I just thought you know you could even color this you know so you can change the color if you wanted to just really gorgeous and I don't know if the camera is picking up look at those hearts and color those hearts little flowers. I don't know if you can see if that they're flowers, but they're flowers. And these little, I don't know what those are called, but this is really, really gorgeous. And these are little triangles, little X's all over. And I got the Christmas one and our holiday catalog, August, August 4th, demos can pre-order. And then September 1st, the holiday catalog, catalog goes live. So I'm not sure when we can order the actual catalogs. And I'm hoping they have Halloween and Thanksgiving and some different Christmas paper. 
and even a Hanukkah stamp because I'd like to be able to offer in my community. But this is very pretty, really can go with anything. And it doesn't really speak Christmas, so you might be able to use this not only for Christmas, but for other, you know, layering colors. Well, that one, maybe not, but they will make cute little cards. So my Christmas or my holiday class, it's gonna, I've called it Bag It and Tag It. I don't have samples yet going to be fun and this is schoolhouse I love these little bicycles and geometric patterns and again polka dots and lined paper you know when you're in um, kindergarten first grade learning to write your alphabet that'll be fun have your young child make grandma and grandpa uh, a card and let them write out the sentiment. And then alphabet and little squares, more stripes and polka dots, and numbers. Really cute. And this one is sweet little thing. There's washi tape that goes with, coordinates with this. Little turtles, little heart vines, clouds, so cute. Foxes, little dots and circles, Z's, little pine trees, stars, more clouds, stars, little circles and dots, and strawberries. Oh, those are so cute. And then they also sent me another neutral designer series pack. Apparently the first one they sent out, there was something wrong. So anyone, customers and demos, they were you know, putting this in, you know, your your next order. So I don't know what was off, but something was off. So I got a free pack. And then I got the build a banner. So I'm gonna make my banner for my name. And this one is a little bit different than the other one. It's got the heart, the heart. And it's got the scalloped edge and then this little fancy that goes along with our tack topper punch and comes with the thick twine, a stamp and mist, the alphabet, This little stencil, that one, and that one, and then some mask, and then a circle one, so you can cover the banner part that you don't want to cover, and this is where the letter goes, and some stripes, and the polka dots. So very cute. And then I got Christmas paper. Uh, real red. And this is just 24 sheets of the same color. And I got the Merry Moments assorted pack. And this year the catalog 
when they have the designer series paper they also are selling coordinating cardstock which makes it easy to buy matching so this has and it doesn't say what colors are in here I think it's cherry cobbler old olive and maybe the slate and then I got a pack of the old olive so that was my haul and I appreciate you watching and let me know what you think what was your favorite paper pack and hope I'm filming this on 4th of July so I hope you and your family and friends stay safe and God bless America catch you in my next video bye bye